farmer's market for the freshest produce. My sales specials and vegan enthusiast Maisha Wynn is here with some farm and fuel salad ideas. Perfect for the summer. Woo. Good morning, Maisha. She's bringing the jacket out too. Is this an early birthday dance? Because I hear it's somebody's birthday. It is. Tomorrow's my big day. Woo. They have such fresh produce, right? Fresh veggies, fresh fruit from local farmers right here in the Midwest, from Michigan to downstate Illinois. So right here, we have some amazing blueberries that are from the farmer's markets, mixed greens, red onions, tomatoes. I love Roma and uh, Roma and <laughs> juicy red tomatoes. Yes, cherry. So yes. Good. I wish you guys could smell it. Yes. It's so fresh. Yes, yes, yes. One of the things about the farmer's market, though, is you always think, oh, it's going to be really expensive, but you can still get all your fresh produce at a reasonable price. Absolutely. So what I love about it, so let's say if you live in a food desert, they accept link cards, which is really good. So there's no excuse for you to say that you can't eat fresh produce. Yeah. So it goes as far north as Evanston to as far south as South Shore or Inglewood. Wow. That's so good to know. All right, so are we mixing something up right here? Yes, we okay. are. Show me so I love kale, Sierra, yeah, because kale has everything. It's like your best friend for life. It has protein, it has vitamin C, vitamin K, vitamin E, all the proper nutrients. So I've already massaged it because most people think oh. that kale is really bitter and it's really hard, but I've already massaged it with extra virgin olive oil. Mm -hmm. So we're going to put some shredded carrots, which are in season. Okay. So, oh, I, I didn't realize that. There we go. And then we get a little bit of almonds. That's right? right. Raw almonds, which are in season already, and blueberries. Okay. Wait, so you massage this? Yes, you want to massage that. So this, 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 this kale already went to your spa? It already <laughs> went to my spa, right? So it's extra smooth like a baby's bottom. Okay, can I try it? Oh, yeah, absolutely. I absolutely. Awesome. I feel like it makes it look so much more appetizing, too, because kale is kind of dry on its own. But when it's so you want to massage it. Some of the it is. It is. And so there's various types of kale, but I love to use the curly kale. Love it. I've been doing it wrong. Well, we've got a salad. Now right. we need to learn how to make some dressing. But here, you know, give a little recipe that can make a healthy dressing. That's right. So people don't know that all the calories in any salad is in the dressing. Yeah. So what I love about red wine vinaigrette is that it lowers your blood sugar, it lowers your cholesterol, and it really helps you with your tummy. Okay. As well as the digestive system. So, so red wine okay. vinaigrette. A little bit of that. Yeah. A little splash of That's that. That's right. Uh, you want to use a little bit of extra virgin mm -hmm. olive oil. Okay. Equal amounts? Yes, equal okay. amounts. And, and then this is, is agave maple syrup, a oh, mixture okay. of both. Okay. Now, I'll we'll that up. I hear you're going to be at the Taste of Chicago. I am going to be at the what Taste of Chicago. Chicago. I am one of their celebrity chefs. Oh. So I'll be there Friday, July 15th. I'll be opening what? it up at 11.30 a.m. and closing it out at 5.30 p.m. And it's all about veganism. And it'll take place at the Lightweight Foods Taste Kitchen. Oh, that's so cool. to you. All right, guys, check out Taste of Chicago on Friday. You can join the vegan conversation. And you'll be able to catch Maisha twice, like she said. You can also keep up with Maisha on Facebook and Instagram at Live to Win and on Twitter at Live to Win One. Thank you so much for coming in today. That's right, tossing it up. Tossing it up.